guys what's up welcome back to another vlog or welcome if you're new today is going to be my sunday reset routine but essentially it's just going to be a vlog of what my sundays usually consist of so like laundry going grocery shopping planning and prepping for the week ahead and i always do yoga on sundays so obviously i did some yoga at home this morning i have been taking classes but this morning i just didn't feel like leaving the house I had a really slow morning and so I just did a guided yoga session at home. I watched it on my iPad and just kind of followed that. And it has been the nicest morning. I don't know, I'm, I'm in a good mood today. This is my sweet little puppy. Yes, him has been such a little angel all morning. <laughs> Are you mommy's angel? That's a big yawn, baby Stetson. Baby Stetson. Oh, <laughs> I think I scared him. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Chad went paintballing this morning with a bunch of guys from work, so we won't be going grocery shopping until later. So I'm gonna wait for him to go do that. I never go grocery shopping by myself. I know like in a lot of couples, the woman will usually go like if the guy's not available. I literally refuse to go grocery shopping by myself. So if one of us can't go for some reason, like when Trooper had a surgery and one of us had to be with him, like Chad went grocery shopping because I can't grocery shop by myself. I'm like incapable of it. I, I just get like so nervous. I don't know why grocery stores scare me when I'm by myself, but like I'll go to Target, no problem. Here's the Sunday fit. I'm usually just wearing something comfortable, but enough to where I can get some stuff done around the house. So here we are. I'm wearing this super comfy bra that I found on Amazon. Oh my gosh. I don't know how I haven't told you guys about this sooner. So it looks like a sports bra. Like you see, you know, it fits kind of like a sports bra, but it actually has no wires. Uh, it does come with padding, but I took the padding out of mine and it reminds me of seamless underwear. It's completely seamless, but like, you know, the Victoria's Secret pink, like seamless underwear. It's just like those, like super thin, very, very, very comfortable. So this is like my, when I'm working from home kind of a bra and I like it because it does kind of look like a sports bra. It also gives you the support of a sports bra, but it's not tight and uncomfortable. Cause sometimes if you try to wear a sports bra like all day or something, it's, it can be like constrictive. This, this feels like you're wearing nothing. It actually feels better than wearing a sports bra at all. So I'll link it it's from Amazon and it's actually less than $30. So I already bought two of these cause that's how much I love them. Um, and then I'm also wearing this little like one shoulder pullover that's from Windsor. And I always get questions about this whenever I wear it. It's just like, I don't know, so cute, very comfortable. And then I'm wearing my black Lululemon aligns. These are my new ones. I just ordered a new pair cause I just wear them so much that I thought I might as well just have another plain black pair. And then, you know, socks cause who needs shoes? We're just working at home.
this Sunday is really just off to a great start. I have my laundry going, I disinfected the counters, cleaned out the old stuff out of the refrigerator for this week. I also changed our bed sheets, dusted, vacuumed, and I did all of that because of course I would do that anyway, but with the intentions of when Chad comes home, he'll be so happy that I cleaned up the whole house and then hopefully I can ask him to wash the dogs because they really need a bath and I don't feel like doing it. So I'm gonna use this to my advantage. I did all of this, will you please give the dogs a bath? Genius. Here's my lunch for today. Oh my gosh, steaming fresh hot leftovers from last night. Smells amazing. Sometimes leftovers taste better the next day and I feel like this meal is about to be one of them. While I'm eating lunch, I'm just going to plan out our meals for the week. I'm still waiting for Chad to get home, but I'm just gonna like tentatively come up with some meal ideas so that way we can go to the grocery store. from the grocery store I'm gonna do a quick little grocery haul for you guys so I got this lime and watermelon aha uh -huh, sparkling water this is so good the orange is my number one favorite but I still have some orange ones left so we decided to get this one it's like my second favorite flavor so good got strawberries blueberries bananas and cuties little clementines these are so good two avocados because I want to make some avocado toast this week I haven't made it in a while and then I got some eggs. I found this cauliflower pizza that has Italian sausage and vegetables. And it just looked really good. It's like really high in protein and it's made with cauliflower. So, you know, sometimes you just gotta have a little treat. And then, <laughs> and then I got some carrots, um, hummus, banana chips. These are like one of my favorite little sweet snacks. I got coconut flour because I'm going to try and make Chad and I some healthy blueberry muffins and I'm going to use coconut flour to do it. And then I also got another bag of muesli, my favorite breakfast, sweet potato fries to go with our veggie burgers later this week, coconut milk because I'm going to use this with the chia seed pudding, oat milk because that's what I make my lattes with, and then this is like my favorite cereal of all time. It's um, the Cascadian Farm Cinnamon Crunch. I've shown you guys this before. It is not like healthy by any means like it's still high in sugar it's still processed but sometimes i just like to have it as a little dessert and i got more cinnamon because i use this every morning and um that is it very short spread we already had a lot of the staple pieces that we needed for our food this week trooper looks naked because chad gave him a bath stetson looks naked too we'll get stetson's fur when he just like got a bath today it's all like, I don't know how to describe it. It looks like, I was telling Chad, it looks like his fur was supposed to go on like, um, low tumble dry, and you just dried it like not according to the direction. <laughs> oh, 
God bless. Well, we are cooking dinner now and I'll show you guys how to make this super easy soup. It's perfect if you've had a really busy day and you just want something quick and easy. It is busy day soup. So the first step is to cook one pound of ground beef and then we're gonna drain this. And then after you drain it, you are going to add it all into a big pot like so. Also, Chad's wearing a shirt. <laughs> Rare <laughs> occasion. <Once. laughs> okay, and then once the meat's in there, we're gonna add five cups of water. So I have one cup here in this little guy. And then I filled this one up with four cups. Five cups of water. And then one 14.5 ounce can of diced tomatoes with the juice. So just dump this all in there. I did not open this can enough. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Looks gross right now, but I promise it's gonna be wonderful. And then we're gonna add two packets of Lipton onion soup. Easiest soup ever, it's so good. Stir that all together. I'm gonna pop a lid on here and then we're just gonna let this simmer for one hour and then I will be back. Okay, it's now an hour later. So now the final step is to add in one and three fourths cups of frozen mixed veggies and then one cup of elbow noodles. Stir that in and then we're going to turn the heat up to medium and let this cook for 15 minutes and then it's ready. So while that's cooking, I just got my gym outfit ready. You guys ask me all the time how I have motivation to go to the gym in the morning. And to be honest, one of the things that helps me the most is just having everything ready to go so that when I get up, I don't have to think about anything. It doesn't matter if I'm tired. I just come right in here and get dressed and go. I also like to get out my BCAAs and my little blender bottle and just have this right on the counter for in the morning as well as my water bottle to fill up that way. It's just ready to go. Here is the final product of this yummy soup. It's so easy to make, as you guys could tell. So Chad and I are gonna eat dinner, and we're also gonna eat this for leftovers tomorrow because it makes a ton. Well, it's much later now, and Chad and I are about to watch some Netflix and just wind down for the night, and then we will move to the bedroom where we will read for about 20 minutes. That's kind of been our routine. And that's pretty much it for my Sunday reset routine. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And if you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.